it's actually far from the morning it's like two o'clock and i'm just now starting this vlog because i'm the worst so yesterday hi it's dark wait wait oh my gosh so yesterday my roommate and i decided our color scheme for our dorm room so as you can tell from the title i'm going dorm shopping <laughs> something i've been looking forward to my entire life not kidding fun fact about my hair i slept on it like this and i thought maybe if i put a bandana on it it'll look cute it still doesn't i think i might I just look home not homeless but i feel like i look like one of those like weird school teachers it looks cuter like in person i feel like but that could just be me like in denial i'm also wearing a dress because that's what girls do and this dress is ugly and i wanted to change but i don't have to wear a bra when i wear this dress Okay, I'm back. I changed from like a nice little dress to like pajamas, but does it look like I care? Nope. I'm in my car. Buckle. We're going to Target. My tire pressure's low. Living life on the edge has been low for like two weeks. Yikes. Fun fact, last time my tire pressure was low, my tire popped and I had to make Dylan. Do you guys remember Dylan? Aw, TBT. He had to change my tire in the middle of our school parking lot during his lunch period. I mean, we weren't even dating back then. Good guy. Thanks, Dylan. You guys ready for Target? Okay, I'm gonna drive to Target. I missed you. Yes, Target, Target, Target. Ah. Uh. I have no idea what I need to buy, actually. Yeah, when I was 12, I had this list of things that I needed for college. So, moral of the story, I was more prepared for college when I was 12 than I am now. I don't know what I, I should go on Pinterest. They have like those lists. I'm just gonna buy some throw pills real quick, okay? This is so overwhelming. I'm overwhelmed, I need my mom. These are so cute, but do I need them? I might need them. I don't know why, but I might. Let's see what else we got. Ooh, I don't need that. My roommate said she wanted to get that for herself. Ooh, those are cute, but I don't need them. Where's all the cute pillows at? Where's Target hiding their cute pillows? Is it in here? Oh, guys. Story time. Okay, ready for this? I heard a kid growl at a mom. Yeah. Oh, I found the cute pillows. I'm literally just like in this section right now. Oh, these are big pillows. They're a lot bigger than they looked online. So, funny story. For Christmas and my birthday, I got a bunch of Target gift cards, like a bunch. And so I was like, you know what? I'm gonna use them for my dorm room. I spent them all. I was planning on just saving them so I don't have to spend money on my dorm room. And it was like free dorm decorate. No, I spent all of it. Okay. This is cute. This is big though. Really big. There you go. I want this one. Oh, that one. These are so big though. Are these for couches? Or are these for beds? I don't know. Oh, this one's cute. I wonder if this will match my bedding. Can I return these if I don't like them? Cute. I need another cart. I was expecting these to be small. Not big. This one's cute. Are these things expensive? Ooh, maybe. No, that's kind of... Oh, what is that? How much are this? Okay. This little pillow is $17, so I'm kind of nervous to see how much these ones are. Let's take a moment and pray for my financial stability. Can't find the price tag. They probably do that on purpose. They probably hide the price tag on purpose. Okay, so couldn't find... I'm gonna need to put some money in my bank account. In my bank account. But seriously though, I need another card. Ooh, let's take a thumbnail. Oh, it needs to be lower. Okay, that's probably good. I think these pillows are gonna be too big, but they're really cute. I can always return them. What else do I need? I don't know what else I need. All I'm bringing to college is throw pillows, guys. Cause that's all that can fit in my cart. Stop. Okay, should I bring him to college? 10 retweets and I'll do it. Interesting. Ooh, bedding. I think I'm gonna get my bedding from Urban Outfitters. Why is this pillow $6 and this one $62? And why do I want the $62 one? I'm not gonna get it, but I want it. I literally put my head on all these pillows and that's probably really gross. This kind of looks like the one from Urban Outfitters that I'm getting, but the one from Urban Outfitters is cuter and more expensive. <laughs> do you guys ever just like hate your style of taste and you're like, why can't I just be cheap? Like why? That guy, that one right there, he just saw me vlog and judged me so hard. <laughs> So I read that I'm supposed to get four bath towels. Is this one cheaper than this one? Are they different? These ones are, the cheaper ones are softer. Are these ones bigger? And then it said I get a lot of washcloths, but like, do I really need like 10 washcloths? Let's get this one. It's cheaper. Okay. How am I going to afford all this? College is expensive. I'm scared to move out now, guys. I was so excited. And now I'm just looking at the price tags of things. I'm like, wait, what? Will she pick up? Pick up. She's not gonna pick up. They already have school supply stuff. <gasps> but like, guys, have they not put it all out or is it just like gone? Have people already taken it? Ooh, pen. Um, mm -hmm. Have people taken all this stuff? Have they not finished putting it out? I don't think they finished putting it out. Yeah, they haven't finished putting it out. Okay, I'm good. Will she answer? Answer, come on. I feel like these would be nice to store stuff in, but I don't know. I have no idea what my dorm room looks like or how big it is or like what comes in or what the dimensions are. I've Googled it like 10 times and they don't have any information. I don't even know people that have lived there. I need help. I'm miserable. Shouldn't have done this alone i keep facetiming people to help me but no one's answering i need a laundry basket right right but like which one this isn't even a question i need these i heard they need to have an on and off button kind of liking this one because there's the usb but what but this one's black but it's five dollars cheaper than this one america explain just kidding just kidding just kidding i want to get two picture frames for my friends so i can take a picture and um frame it but i'm trying to pick out a good one i want to like mail it to them and be like look how cute we are Ooh. Hmm. Hmm. 
Which ones will they like? I don't know. This wasn't what I was expecting. Ooh, it's expensive. What the heck? Why are picture frames expensive? They're like this big. I needed this. Mine cracked. And then I heard this foundation is really good, so I wanted to try it out. Mine's a little too dark for me right now. My tan has been fading because I haven't been outside in like a month because it's so hot outside it's a real tan someone commented on one of my instagram posts something like when are you gonna scrub that fake tan off you look so stupid or whatever and i was over here like crying it's a real tan i don't think can it's a real tan and it's fading because um i don't go outside anymore <laughs> i don't know what else i need <laughs> It's good. I'm really debating these pillows. Is this too dark for me? Is it darker than my arm? I've decided I'm not gonna get the pillows. You know what? I really like this one. It's like really long. So this was a fail. Oh, hey. Way too much money at Target later. I'm here. Not to be dramatic because I know I'm an extremely dramatic person, but I feel like I'm gonna faint and die. Yeah. My head just really, really hurt. And it's amazing because I need to drive 15 minutes to my friend's house and 15 minutes back. And I might get my tire pressure fixed while I'm on the way because I'm not trying to get a flat tire because I just saw someone fix their flat tire and I feel like that's a sign from like God to get my tire pressure fixed. Okay, thanks God. I'm so annoyed. Oh my God, that was so loud. <laughs> I'm so annoyed. <laughs> My dogs are very concerned that noise I just made. Story time. So I drove to my friend's house, picked up my fan right there. Been at her house for like two months now, sorry. Drove there, picked it up. Then I drove all the way to the tire place. There's a place where you can drive in, they like fix your tire pressure and you leave. Cool, okay, cause I don't know how to do it. I'm incapable of doing anything myself. So yeah, go there. The entrance is blocked off by some stupid idiot with a like RV so I can't get in and I waited there for a while waiting for him to leave and he didn't leave. He just like sat there and I was so, so not only did I waste the gas to drive all the way over there to that place, waited forever, had a really bad headache. I didn't even get my tire pressure fixed. Um, pause for a cute intermission of cute dog. Hi. So my tire pressure's not fixed and my tire might pop and if it does pop, I blame it on that stupid RV. You're annoying. Also, this pillow is so much bigger than I thought it was. In the store, it looked smaller. I also got sunscreen, but that's not important. Hi, editing Keegan here. Nice to meet you. That was so cheesy. <laughs> so filming Keegan is, um, a failure. I forgot to end the vlog, so I'm here ending it. Yeah. Also, I want to apologize for all the negativity at the end. I, I was just having a rough day. I'm sorry. No excuses. Just, I'm sorry. Anyways, I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching. If you want me to do more of these, like, dorm shopping, maybe, like, a successful one next time, let me know. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!